I've never wanted to go my whole life and just be good. I've always wanted to be great. What's crazy about swimming is it's constant training. It's hours upon hours a day to swim for so long just for a moment. But that gold medal lasts forever. What? I think for me the hardest part is jumping in. When I step up right before I'm about to jump in and you know, I'm fixing my cap and goggles and then I push off and everything melts away. Every problem, every thought I have, everything is just gone and it's just me on the water. born with fibular hemomelia. I was missing all the bones in my lower legs. And every time I grew, I had to get surgery. The only time I've actually felt disabled is during the recovery time. I was really active when I was little. I was just always moving around. But over time, my parents were really afraid I would damage my knees. And uh, we found swimming. <laughs> I joined the team at 10 years old. I could swim two strokes and it was so hard. But uh, I love competing against girls with legs and here I am, 14 years later, still doing the sport that I love. You know, all of my life it's being an amputee. You know, I've never really been able to afford slacking off or giving in. There are moments every couple weeks when I start to lose faith and hope and I'm like, I don't know how to swim anymore, it's not feeling right. But then I hit this beautiful set and it's like this effortless feeling. And those are some of the moments and the practices that I live for. Those moments are so rare. You have to soak in the success. Just don't go too fast. I have a moment in every single practice that I want to quit. One of my favorite quotes is, the only disability in life is a negative attitude. If I were to stop and really focus on what I don't have, I wouldn't be where I am today. In swimming, I have to keep moving forward and be resilient, just determined and tough. And in life, I think the same thing. I'm really proud of my medal count, you know, 12 gold. I've worked really hard for that. No one handed that to me. I want to be remembered as the best Paralympic swimmer of all time, and I only have to win one more gold to do that. You can't buy greatness. Work for it and earn it, and sacrifice for it.